Hello viewer, welcome to my YouTube channel Software Testing. Today I'll talk about top three AI tools that you can use every day for your software testing purpose. So as you know, there are multiple AI tools in the market. Today I'll talk about only three, which is top three you can say. First one is the Microsoft Copilot. You want to go to the bing.com, then chat with the Microsoft Copilot. Then Google Gemini, which was in before Google Bard. Now it is a Google Gemini. Then we can talk about chat GPT, which is open product of open AI. You can use that thing. Every AI has the pro version, but I'll use the basic pre version. Let's see how it goes. All the three AI, I will ask same question. Can you please write Java method with two parameter? Let's see how they respond. So that that is today's topic. So let's see how it works. So if you see the interface like it is chat GPT 3.5. Same thing, you can message chat GPT. You can type your prompt or question over here, then chat GPT will give you the answer. And next one is the Microsoft Bing Copilot or Microsoft Copilot, your everyday AI companion. Ask me anything. You can ask over here any question, it will give you the answer. Then next one is the um, Gemini, Google Gemini, which was before Google Bard. So you can enter a prompt here. You can write a question over here. It will give you the answer. So let's see practically how it goes. It's the same question I will ask all three AI. So first one is the Bing, Microsoft Copilot. I can ask a question over here. It is the same question. Let me take it from, copy it from here. Copy and paste it, Microsoft Copilot and hit enter or you can submit over here. So now it is writing. Here is the, it has been already written. So basically public class example, public, let me copy from here, exactly whatever it is, I'll paste it in Eclipse. So let me, my class is created example AI. I'll put it the same thing. Let me delete up to this and I'll put it over here, whatever it is created. So we need to delete this one because we already created class with the example AI. So let's see how it goes. It created parameter with method with two parameter. If this method is one parameter integer A, another parameter integer B. Basically return A plus B. This method will return A plus B. Now we are calling this method from the main, main method in order to run. So integer result, result equal to add numbers. We are calling this method and parameter is five and seven. One integer A is five, integer B is seven. Then it will give you the result seven plus five. It will add and it will give you the result 12. So save it. Let me right click run as. Java application. Let's see in console, it is exactly written sum 12. That means first thing it is working, whatever we ask for the Bing Copilot. So second one will ask for the same question. It is chat GPT. Let me paste, uh, copy the question, copy from here and paste it here and hit enter or submit. So it has written the code. Let me copy that copy code. Here is the class also example. Let me, let me comment out the Bing. Okay, whatever being written, it is written by Copilot. Now let me paste it over here. Chat GPT and paste the code is over here. So same thing already we have a class. We need to delete this line and also we need to delete one per curly bracket because we copied it from here. It is written by chat GPT. So what it has been written, it is a method with param two parameter, integer x and integer y, return x plus y. We are calling this method from the main method. 
integer number 1 equal to 5, integer number 2 equal to 7. So integer sum equal to add, that means we are calling this add method number 1 and number 2. That means when we will run this program, it will um, 7 and 5 equal to 12, it will print out. And the sum of number 1, uh, it, it has been written in the details. So let me save it and run it, right click, run as Java application. The sum of 5 and 7 is 12, exactly whatever needed, it is work as expected. Now is the third one, it is the Google Gemini, we will ask the same question. So let me copy the question over here and paste it to the Google Gemini. Enter over here same thing enter or you can submit from here it is start writing you see that public integer add integer number one integer number two integer sum one and two return sum that means it has been written only without main method it has been written only the method so it is okay this will work too let me copy from here copy from here let's go to the eclipse Basically this part only this part it has been written. It did not written the main method. So let me comment out chat GPT one will do for the Google Gemini. Let me comment out chat GPT. Okay. Now whatever Gemini. Google Gemini. So let me paste it over here the method public integer add integer number one integer number two then into this is two parameter it is the same method with add integer sum one and sample return sum. In order to run this method you need a main method. So basically this method is written by Gemini we are in the main method Gemini did not write wrote the main method so in order to run this code we need a main method so we created main method over here integer sum equal to calling this main method um, created method by Gemini add and we are passing parameter 5 and 7 so then we can print out the result so we can type over here result is colon then concatenate with the variable is the sum so now save it and right click run as java application result is 12 so basically all three ai the code has been written let's say copilot it included with the main method exactly you just copy paste and run it chat gpt is the same thing and only gemini written the method but it did not written the run method i mean main method so you can add that main method that means all three AI tools like Gemini, uh, Bing Copilot and ChatGPT written the code based on your question. So you can use that code for your everyday day-to-day -day purpose for your software testing. So that means AI can help you to write the code that needed for your software testing. I believe those who are new in software testing and also AI tool for writing java code or any language code this will be very helpful for themselves if you think this is helpful please like my video subscribe my channel and share it to others also if you have any question about those ai tool and writing any prompt or any code please make, make a comment i'll get back to you as soon as possible thank you for watching this video